And now, another episode of Crit Camp Gaming. Oh yeah, we're here to play some Hero Realms today. It's September 14th and Cooperative Mode came out on the 13th. That was yesterday. Crit That's right. No. Crit knows in chat. What's going on everyone? We've been playing Hero Realms Digital a bunch. And today, we're going to try out the Cooperative Mode against the one and only Pirate Lord. This was the most recent update. If you were a Kickstarter backer, you saw this information. And cooperative mode is now in the game. What? Um, one thing I will state is that it's not real time. It is 48 hour turn still. Real time is still coming soon, as you can see over here on the right. Um, but it's going to be a lot of fun as we dive into it today with another special surprise. Uh, Bill, Bill I am in chat, the guy we keep mentioning over our Soul Forge Fusion stuff. I've been playing a lot of Soul Forge Fusion with him, which has been a lot of fun. Um, he's been playing some Hill Realms with me and other people. He's checked this out with our buddy Mortivus. Um, I believe he's had a good time. I believe it's been a lot of fun. He said he's got some challenges. We're going to ask him about it. And he's going to join us today. He's making special time to join us to co op with me as Lyle's out fighting real pirate lords on a beach on a boat somewhere else. Right? All right. So gonna be a lot of fun we're gonna bring him in here in just a second um but yeah i wanted to i just wanted to say that uh if, if you back this game and you've been playing it i hope everyone's been having a blast uh i've been having a blast playing with everyone else um oh jxm with the 40 woo! or with the 54 sorry jxm 40 but with the 54 months right thank you for all the support guys i really appreciate it bill even throwing it up there's gonna protect the realms of the pirate menace um evil ed can we defeat captain jack sparrow uh, I mean, Robin. Um, Yvelette, have you been playing uh, the cooperative mode? I don't know if you've tried it yet. Um, but uh, yeah, today is kind of an audible. Yesterday, played some more Soul Forge Fusion. Had a blast um, playing that with Matt last night and subbing in for Lyle instead of some Arkham action. Uh, and that's been a lot of fun. Uh, but I wanted to, uh, I was going to play Rogue Book because we have like a run that's going pretty well and we're about three quarters of the way done. Uh, was going to finish that off, but I was like, you know, let's take, let's take a Richard Garfield break for just a second. And let's jump back to another game we're playing way too much mobile on mobile, which is Hero Realms. Um, uh, but speaking of Soul Forge, I do want to mention tomorrow, Soul Forge 2v2 mode. Matt will join me, and we're going to do a special Wednesday night stream. That's right, guys, we're getting a stream every single day this week already. Uh, Soul Forge Fusion 2v2 mode will be debuted tomorrow. Um, I believe Stoneblade's probably going to tweet out about it today a little bit more. They said they'll maybe make a promo or something. I don't know. They didn't say they will, but I assume they'll promote it. Um, that we'll be joining them tomorrow at 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time, and we'll be showing the 2v2 mode uh, before we step away from the Soul Forge Fusion talk too much. But tried this mode the other day with Matt. It was a lot of fun, guys. Uh, we hate to be taking over the airwaves so much with Soul Forge Fusion, but it's been a blast, and we're just enjoying diving in. And the game keeps changing, so we got to check the new stuff. Um, so before I before I jump into this and talk more about what the Pirate Lord is up to, let's give uh, let's give our buddy Bill a call, huh? Let's give our buddy Bill a call. Let's get him in here. Uh, let's see if I can do this. Let's, let's utilize the discords and hope it works because I don't know I, I haven't done it in a while on the PC, but uh, here's Bill Bill Hello, yay Everybody goes crazy for Bill dude. Everybody goes crazy <laughs> for Bill. What's going on man? What's going on? Uh, it's it's going good. You know, it's a nice nice Tuesday. How are you doing? <laughs> good, man. Good. So Bill joined me for some Soul Forge Fusion this weekend and we had some fun uh, testing out some decks, huh? Yeah, yeah. It's been a uh, been a good time and uh, got a chance to show Mortavos last night and uh, we did a little field action and uh, the decks were pretty wonky, so it was, yeah. it was a good time. Yeah, and they've already nerfed cards that Matt and I used last night. <laughs> they've already nerfed yeah. cards, and uh, they clarified some rules. I mean, that thing is still in development, and it's uh, really cool. But um, you said you've played the Pirate Lord, right? You fought the Pirate Lord in Hero Realms? Yes, uh, I think uh, five games total so far. How many wins? And, uh, How many wins? We uh, are two and three. Two and three, okay. Is this all with Mortivus? Yes. Okay. How long does the average Pilot Lord co-op battle take? Uh, if you're doing your turns uh, pretty quickly, it can go fast. Right. Uh, faster than a normal game, right. for sure. Okay. Um, it ramps up pretty quick, so... All right, well, so I'm looking over here at the Kickstarter page because this is the update they sent out recently with the Pilot Lord information. Um, in in brief, what what does the Pilot Lord do? do exactly uh so the pirate lord you can think of maybe uh like an opponent 
who has different cards in their starting deck. Okay. Uh, so the Pirate Lord will buy cards from the market, hmm. will uh, put out minions, will attack you as well, um, and uh, has some kind of unique abilities I won't spoil. We can kind of experience yeah, yeah. them on air, but um, <laughs> kind of takes a few things from different, uh, different heroes that already exist, okay. and... Uh, the cool thing is you can assist your partner. So you can view their board while they're taking their turn. Right. Um, you can see their hand and uh, kind of coordinate a strategy that way. You can also heal your ally, which is a new ability, and uh, fight their uh, champions off the board uh, if they didn't have enough damage to do so. So have you? So because this is 48-hour turns, uh, we don't do it real time. Have you done all your games like on voice chat with, say, Mortavis, or have you done the 48-hour turn thing and just sort of gone back to back to back? Uh, we did the 48-hour turn, okay. uh, but we were both kind of actively doing it. He was also playing Keyforge at the same time, <laughs> <laughs> so uh, a little bit of multitasking for him. Uh, right. But uh, we were chatting on Discord a little bit, okay. uh, just text text chat. Yeah, I'm thinking. I'm just thinking about you know doing these co-op games. It's going to be really helpful uh battling together and being able to say like i can look at your hand but you know i mean i'm re realizing this when matt and i tested 2v2 in soul forge for instance it's like super helpful being able to like talk to each other and be like all right you know what should we what should we do strat wise or communicate versus the 48 hour thing i don't know i think you would be guessing kind of what my next <laughs> like okay he, he yeah. bought that he bought that green dude where we, we weren't going green strat but uh, okay <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's definitely uh, an advantage to be able to coordinate and uh, right. maybe, you know, you have one person focus on health, okay. uh, healing strats, and the other person focus on damage or something like that. But uh, because the Pirate Lord also buys cards from the market in yeah. between uh, your turn, sometimes you'll leave a card there for your opponent who, or for your uh, friend, and uh, it will be gone by the time they get a buy, so... Ah, uh, yeah, that's true. I didn't even think about that, man. Wow. Well, I'm ready to get into some Hero Realms cooperative then, because, I mean, I want to experience it. I want to get wrecked, <laughs> and I want to I want to go down with you, Bill. We go down yes, with our ship. Yes. Captain Bill? Are you... <laughs> uh, <laughs> get ready. Uh, I was not prepared for the uh, firepower of the first game. Well, knowing, knowing Bill and how you play, you always will take green. So even if we were doing 48-hour turns, I'd be like, well, of course he's just going to take all the discard cards. <laughs> Because that's all yeah. he does to me all the time. <laughs> green, green strat, best strat, but uh, it was not working versus the pirate lord. Oh, uh, interesting, interesting. I did uh, did pivot uh, when I was playing with more of us. Oh, okay. Um, so, so very wrong about games. It's asking, can you play with bots yet, or is it live players only? I believe it's live players only. Is that right, Bill? From what I've read. Uh, as far as I'm aware, I I don't I didn't see an option to. Yeah. Uh, play with an AI on your team. Uh, I think you can match. There, make? there is matchmaking though. Right. So you can match make with random people. So you could, I could challenge. Yeah, exactly. You can challenge a friend, or you can do a random matchmaking like you would one v ones. But yeah, here's the one uh, verse AI menu. Uh, so very wrong, and it's not even an option yet. Um, I'm assuming that will come in, in time. Once again, I have to be clear that this is in testing still. So like. We may run into bugs, things may crash, things may go crazy, but who knows. And I have seen none of it. And as you can see, uh, Drew over here challenged me to a 48-hour game, but I wanted to save it for air. I wanted to save it to go down on the ship with you first, Bill. And then I'll go down on the ship with Drew. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Yeah, so, um, it'll, be, it'll be fun. <laughs> let's set this up. Let's say cooperative, real time. I mean, I can't wait till real time comes out in this game uh, because I timed out on so many games um, even recently with this whole game. When this update came out, it broke everything. <coughs> so I had a few games that just disappeared just because either I wasn't taking my turns or they weren't taking their turns and it, it was whatever. But um, yeah, that's the struggle uh, you got to face when you're you yeah. know, a popular player on the Hero Realms app. <laughs> Hero Realms problems. Hero Realms problems. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, so who, okay, who are you going to play as? I guess we could communicate this, right? Yeah. Um, Should I so, go? I mean, as you, as you know, I'm a thief. Uh, yeah. main that I, I enjoy playing the thief, but uh, I have also been enjoying playing priest in this Dude, uh, priest is great. scenario. I love priest. Um, also, I should make note that when you play at something like my level five ranger, you get reduced to the highest is level three, right? Correct. Yeah, this scenario, the highest you can be is level three. So any 
hero that you do have over that will be reduced in power. Okay, so maybe I'll just start with my... I'm going to start with Arrow. I'm going to start with Arrow just because she's level 5 and have our best chance at maybe surviving here. Uh, Perfect. Let's yeah. see. Cooperative challenge. So I'm going to have to put in your name, right? Because we still can't autofill. So Bill, yeah. I... Wait, it's underscore, right? Uh, two ones instead of the L's, I think. Oh, okay. Oh, it's just Billiam like this? I believe. Let me see. Uh... It's, it doesn't have a space or anything, right? Yeah, I don't think there's a space. Yeah, I, I can't do underscores. So I, I assume... Will confirm. Yeah, I forgot what your... <laughs> I guess I could have looked at my past games list and gotten your name 100% <laughs> before we do yeah, this. Yeah, yeah. You weren't allowed to do spaces or any of that uh, special characters, so it is, yes, just uh, B-I-1-1-I-A-M. Yeah, Billiam. Okay. Yep. No such player. Hold on. What? Let me see why All I... All right. I could challenge you. We can try that. Yeah, challenge me, dude. I'm just spelling it wrong. Uh, Cooperative. You... Oh, it's right there. Uh, Maybe I just spelled it wrong. All right. Yeah, try me, try me, and then we'll get into this game. But yeah, this is what happened with my old games, as Bill invites me, like, I was playing this guy, Lou Dog, incompatible version, Incompa everything just went incompatible. So, timed out. Bam! Bill challenged me to a game, let's get into it. Bill right. and I, versus the Pirate Lord, I accept this challenge, let's go. MC Hammer, and Arrow. Okay, game started with Bill. Excellent. Where are you? Where's the game? Ah, oh, right here, oh, it looks sick. Okay, guys, Pirate, Cooperative Rules, Cooperative Play, two players, team to battle an AI opponent. Like Bill said, uh, we fight with our own air on the board. And then if there's prepared enemy champion, you can choose to use healing effects on your ally instead of yourself. You can attack your ally's opposing champions. Okay, cool. So you're going to be our healer, and I am the... Damn it. Whoop! There's the rules. You're gone. Okay. All right, so whose turn is it? Uh, I'm not sure. Let me... Oh, I guess if I click it, it starts the game. Oh, okay. You had to start the game. Okay. So here we go, guys. Co-op time. Let's fight the Pirate Lord. 60 health. And uh, all right, perfect, great start. No, uh, nothing to buy, but uh, you know, Barracks over there. So okay, y'all. Uh, yeah, we, we know the Dark Lord has made his <laughs> appearance, and Rake. These are my two favorite dudes right here. So, yeah, so uh, I know uh, you can click on my board, and yep. then you get the blue haze. I'm watching. Uh, so I will. So what did he buy? Start. He he went green strat, dude. He went green strat hard. Yeah, uh, stole stole our green cards. Uh, Both sparks. So we'll have to yeah, make him pay for that. Uh, so get some money. Get some money, dude. That's how we win this game. <laughs> yeah, big plays, dude. Big plays. Big fire gym plays. Good work. <laughs> yeah. And so he buys before each of our turns, as you see. He just bought some uh, oh, red cards. Oh, are you? Oh, he's got these special cards. Three damage plus yep. one for each broadside in play. Are you kidding, dude? Yeah. Yep, it's it's similar to the uh, knives for the thief. Dude, this feels like Ion's End uh, difficulty. <laughs> That's what this is right now. We just hit Ion's End difficulty. So he just hit me for 10 damage to the face. Yep. Uh, that's been my experience where it seems like sometimes he will just uh, focus down one one person. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Um, so I've got my level 3, I guess, ability, my headshot. I mean, stun target champion and draw a card. Um haven't been playing. So so what did you buy? You just got money. You didn't do anything. But, yeah, I couldn't afford anything yet. Um, Do we want to get more money and buy up to, like, the Varix, or should I start grabbing damage heroes here? Like, I was thinking of Master Weigh-In. Welcome, Mr. Draco. Thank you for the 33 months, man. Appreciate it. Yeah, uh, I think the champions are always good. It buys uh, yeah. us time and health. Well, he's got um, these cards. He, where, where was this thing? He could, like just nail us for free or something like that broadside us acquire the cheapest card in the market row for free that's weird uh yeah so he has some abilities like the broadside that uh, depends on how many he has at, at a time right. uh so that gets weaker as he buys more cards um oh my god less likely to be there and then uh he has some things to stun champions uh yeah i'm just looking at his cards right abilities. now set sail draw two cards oh my god yeah, yeah. Okay, I'll go. I'm gonna grab uh, damage. Yeah, and the other thing, he has a card that uh, will destroy the most expensive card in the market. So, so he can get the cheapest card for free, and then get the most expensive card in the market. He can destroy it. So he's he's blob. He's he's blobnar. Yep. Yeah, uh, yeah. He's he's Star Realms blob time. Okay. All right. So we got. Uh... 
like five. You got five bucks? So. You know exactly you what go. you need to buy. You know exactly what you need to buy with five bucks. <laughs> yeah, you, it's uh. You should buy the Guild that. Mage, but you're not going to. You know what you I have like, to buy. I like Dire Wolf as well. Dire Wolf's pretty good. But Bill, the Dark Lord. He summons. Uh, <laughs> we will be punished. So we'll, we'll, we'll get him uh, yes. over here uh, and uh, end our turn. Oh my god, that was the worst play we could do, right? <laughs> uh, we just need to keep it out of his hands, so. Sacrifice the most expensive card in the row and do five damage to my face. Great. Yeah. Well, we didn't care about that guy. Ow. Yep. If I use my ability on you, it'll also buff your champions too, so. Um, what's your ability again right now? The the healing? Oh, to give me an extra Heal health. Heal right. and give them an give give each champion an extra health. Right, right. Yeah, Zession, this is not a Garfield game. <laughs> I know. I know. I called an audible and I was excited that if Bill wasn't available to play. Um Oh, I forgot I could have done my ability there, sorry. I've been playing too much uh, priest, just throwing cards out. Um Okay, so I'm at four or five bucks. Uh, Rally the troops is pretty good. Yeah, I mean, I, I could keep the going yellow pretty team. pretty good. I mean, we went yellow team. I could stay yellow team. Um, yeah. oh, I wish I had one more dollar, dude. Having the health is nice. Uh, but the money's good, you too. Can use it on either of us, depending on who needs it. All right, because we've got we've got a master way, and I'll take a... We'll, we'll just stay yellow team, and you're, you're being our money maker. Maybe you'll be able to get the mythos mage. Oh, dragging. <laughs> I know, great. That thing's going to get wrecked, right? Uh, yeah, yeah I, I don't think we'll be able to afford that anytime soon. Yeah. Yes, yeah, the first playthrough co-op mode session in this. Okay, let's see what he does here. It's going to draw two cards. Ow. Oh, he hit you finally. Good. Yeah. Uh, all right. Uh... All right, so you've got Varric. You know who's coming out, the Dark Lord. We do. We got we got Varric. I'm just looking. Okay. Oh, you don't have another dollar, though. It would have been perfect to grab a Lore Weaver. I, I can't, I can't uh, afford anything, so. We're only going to be pulling uh, out one of your followers, man. Uh, I might I might leave him got so it. I can try to buy some stuff. What are you going to buy? Next turn. Uh, select none. Oh yeah, that's right. Forty-eight hour turns. You're you're actually doing things. <laughs> I can't wait for real time. Yeah, real time. All right. So can't afford anything. Yeah. I think I will heal instead of buying. Right. You're gonna keep Varric and your follower alive, man. Nice. Yep. Nice. I can't uh, get rid of this elite captain. Uh. So. Yeah. That'll be on you. <laughs> well, he got rid of the Marauder, at least. Yeah. The, the weird thing with the scripting is uh, it looks like he activates the captain before playing as Marauder, so he doesn't Trigger. do it in the right order. Oh, good. Yeah. <laughs> good for us now to get a win. Well, I'm just going to turn right, down right. Uh, the sound. My volumes were all messed up after this most recent update. Um, oh, I was right. I didn't have way in out. Okay, what is this? Uh, stun any champion I want. Um, and draw a card. Okay, let's see what we can get out here. Um, I've only got three bucks, so I'm not going to be able to buy anything. So I'm going to... I'm going to go track some stuff down. And then draw... I might yep. just draw a card to get rid of this Marauder thing. So you're saying he'll trigger the Marauders before... Or will he go one, two, and then trigger this and then do it again for four damage? I've noticed uh, if the captain is out at the start of the turn, uh, he'll use it it'll first. automatically exhaust it before playing the Marauders and getting the extra damage. Okay. Uh, I don't know if that'll continue to happen, though. Let's see. If I throw out three bucks, I can't buy anything. That sucks. So I'm just going to go I'm gonna go tracking rather than grab money, huh? Do we want yep. more money? I mean, we've got big dudes out there. And I guess I could yeah. grab my troops. It could be nice to try to clear some dudes. Uh, get something when you cycle through, but I can see also trying I'm gonna to craft go. your hand. YOLO! Yes! Sweet. We got exactly what we need. I can grab Rally the Troops. 
Uh, put Radley Troops there, and then I'm going to pop my thing to uh, stun target champion and draw my troops. Awesome. What? I can't... Oh, I have to... Oh, I still have to target the guards first? Yeah, so if you pop your master way in now, you could... Uh... Yeah, I could have I could have done that. So can I undo here? How do I undo? Oh, it won't let uh, me because I drew. Oh, that sucks. Oh, that sucks, man. I can't back out of this. So I'm gonna have to select one of these one buys. Boo! But it's okay, because I can just we'll be able to clear it anyway. I've got enough yep. damage to just clear all the champions. The Marauders, or the Captain's probably not a huge priority right now because he's played a bunch of Marauders, so maybe we can... Uh, just save the damage, you think? Yeah, maybe get rid of him. I've also noticed with the Tithe Priest, I, I haven't ever seen him use the healing ability, so... So you, you don't think I should take... You think I should go for face? You think grinding him down? Yeah, yeah. I think going for face could be good. It's 11 damage, all right. He's not gaining any damage, so yeah, I agree. Okay. This is a different type of game. We're not against a person. It's good right, to know that right. you know that stuff. Yeah, some of the scripting, I think, uh, maybe could be updated. Uh, but yeah, you're like right. How, how it uses it. Yeah, you're right. He just triggered his guy before he threw anything out. Yep. So he does he does yeah. his champions before. That seems like an easy bug they could uh, adjust. <laughs> I mean, I'm yes. saying that out of not being someone who develops AI. <laughs> right, right. Uh, so we're, we're going to get the rot here. Get some more red red strats. Grabs the red strats. Okay, it's good. We'll uh, clear out some stuff. Right. You going to grab this mm -hmm. Tithe Priest? Do we trigger combos off yellow champions with each other? Uh, No. We do not. So my weigh-in won't get extra damage based on your champions being on the board? That's, that's how uh, that's how I, I've noticed. I don't think it does. Dang. Um, so I guess we can do this. I mean, I guess grabbing it's not bad, obviously. Um, so very wrongs asking, what do we feel about Keyforge being temporary canceled? I mean, it's on hold. You know, I mean, I hate to use the word canceled as, you know, there's a lot of things coming out. Garfield's doing a lot of things. Fantasy Flight's obviously put it on hold, but given excuses, the, the next set is done. Um, I mean, it sucks. It sucks. I mean, it's what's actually, oh, bam. And I know, I know there's been mixed chatter about Soulforge Fusion sort of like jumping in while Keyforge is going on hold. And so who knows what's going to happen, but... For me, personally, I think... I'm, I'm glad Soulforge Fusion has come about to fill the void uh, for new content. <laughs> <laughs> um, and the difficulty of getting stuff for Keyforge. New stuff, that is. Um, so I'm bummed. I'm bummed a little bit. But at the same time, I feel like I'm excited about a new thing that's coming out. And hopefully it'll come out later on and, and re-spark the Keyforge interest. How do you feel, Bill? I mean, you're a big Keyforge player, too. Yeah, I mean, it's definitely a little bit disappointing for sure. Yeah. Uh, you know, it seems like they're at least being transparent, which is good. Right. Uh, just a little sad to know that it's going to take a while to uh, to see a new set come out. But uh, I still really enjoy the game. I still have a lot of fun playing it. So. Yeah, exactly. We're still going to keep playing it for sure. I still have a bunch of... I mean, I tried to get AOA decks, more AOA decks recently. Which I got a return. I don't know if anyone's in the Discord or saw that. I ordered a display. Ally cannot be healed. It just told me. Okay. Uh, if they, if there's champions on the board in front of you, you can't heal me. Ah, uh, that sucks. Any champion? Yeah. Even yeah. if they're so not you guards. Have, so. You have to clear out his side before you can either fight my side or heal me. I guess I'll remove his damage here. And I'm going to get some money, because I feel like we're never going to be able to... Or should I get money or get the Death Cultist? Probably money, right? Uh, Yeah, I mean, both could be good. Either I one. I have no... I don't have any big money plays right now. Yeah. I'm going to wait. Yeah, money you, could be good. You've got the... If you need to grab the Cultist, you've got the red team, if he doesn't grab it, I guess. 
Yeah, I should be able to get uh, four. I'll have four bucks this next upcoming turn. All right. Um. Yeah, that's kind of my opinion on it. So very wrong. I mean, I'm kind of bummed. I mean, it's nice to know that they're discussing a digital implementation. It doesn't guarantee it'll happen. Or that it's even started happening, or who's going to do it. They didn't mention any of that. So until they mention who's in who's actually developing it, I'm not going to get, I guess, overly excited about the Keyforge digital version because I've been waiting for it for so many years. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know? Um, I'm glad that something like Soulforge Fusion and Richard Garfield and Justin Gary, if you read Justin Gary's developer notes, I recommend everyone go watch, or go read it. It's on his blog, Justin Gary's blog. He goes into depth about his collaboration with just uh, Richard Garfield and what happened when Keyforge was known and what was going on with Keyforge and what they learned from Keyforge and what kind of implies what they were, why he's now doing Soulforge Fusion versus Keyforge anymore. And by he, I mean Richard Garfield, because Justin Gary created Ascension and they wanted the next new thing. And they learned a lot of stuff based on algorithmic card generation, OP events, um, developing cards for that type of algorithm. Oh, dang it! <laughs> they called your cars, dude. Um, yep. You know, there's a lot of stuff that that just... Have, I don't know if you read that art, uh, blog entry yet, Bill, but definitely check it out. I recommend everyone go read it if you're interested in Keyforge and if you're interested, especially in Ascension and so forth, but uh, Soulforge Fusion because it talks about how they met and how Keyforge was a thing and then what they learned from that to now make Soulforge Fusion and hopefully do what they were trying to do with Keyforge that didn't work. Digital implementation, uh, breaking the meta... That kind of thing. Making it so you can just do your own thing and make it truly unique. Yeah. 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 The digital uh, release, if they are able to do that when Keyboard relaunches, I think will be huge for... Yeah, if it's ready to go, right? Getting getting some faith back from the community. Uh, yeah, that's true. So, uh, yeah, I mean, digital for Soulforge for sure is exciting. I didn't get a chance to read the article, but... Um, yeah, I like read it. What they're doing and they're yeah. very responsive to the community which is great yeah exactly and it's developing like i just said at the beginning last night did matt and i played and after bill and i played the cards changed <laughs> and then that's when yeah. i learned about like uh i think it was botanist the first time and a few things and then used them with matt um and already those cards changed before yesterday and then we played yesterday and cards have already changed so it's been really cool how they really want to take advantage of tabletop sim and change the game to make it better for everyone they're really listening to the community before the game's even fully developed which is cool um, yeah, yeah, it's been fun, and uh, the the two player version I think is another cool thing that you don't get. Uh, yeah. With Keyforge. Yeah, yeah, dude, you, you're gonna. It's dude, it's fun. I can't, I can't express more. I can't wait till we can do it officially <laughs> on tabletop sim. Because when we played it, and guys, join us tomorrow. We're gonna be playing Soulforge Fusion tomorrow with Stoneblade. Uh, Matt and I will take on Stoneblade devs. Um, it's a really fun mode and a really fun way of playing the game. Uh, it's just so interesting. It's so because a lot of it has to do with. Um, table talk like you're listening to the other team communicate and trying to be sneaky but if you listen in you're like oh <laughs> you know like yeah yeah I, the, <laughs> should we do this or do this what do you think yeah uh, yeah it's like what they're scared of these things yeah do we save this for later yeah and and you say like you realize what they're focused on so you start going like maybe we can draw we can buff this guy's like uh attack to a value that just distracts them so that we can do right. x right and then if you see that they if they take the bait you know what I mean? And then you're like, ha <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Table talk. Uh, oh, it's great. It's always fun in games. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to toss a gold because he's he's doing your strat and making me discard cards. Yeah. I've been yeah. here. I've learned from you. I've learned from uh, being attacked by you. Um, yeah. I'm yeah. actually thinking of doing a tracking draw here. Yeah, um, if you get another uh, What am I going to do with a recruit? I don't, I mean, a recruit's great, I guess, for healing and stuff and money, but. Yeah, yeah, there's a chance if you track, you only have eight cards, you could get your second arrow and draw multiple cards this turn. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, I think either way, it's not super bad. I mean, let's see, I've got my Horn of Calling, great. Uh, so I could get the recruit for, no, the recruit's an action. Um, I might just take my Fire Gem and just grab the recruit, I guess. Yeah, Fire Gem could be good, and then you could, uh, Take the recruit. Off that. All right, whatever. Didn't get anything big. I'm just sort of cycling, I guess. Whoop! I got got a little server lag here. I've got the spinning ball of death in the bottom right corner. So wait till I catch up. Uh, uh, what's what's yeah, my there, favorite? Uh, what's your favorite personal deck name in Keyforge? 
What's favorite Keyforge deck name? For me? Are you saying for me? Um, this in chat's asking. Uh, so uh, very okay. wrong's asking. What's your? I don't. I mean, I have so many. Hmm. Oh well. well I have a personal one. It didn't do well in uh, or it actually did really well in organized play. It was like one of my first organized play sealed events. Uh, let's see. We'll get rid of the Marauder. Uh, we'll go two to the Pirate Face. What are you sitting at? You're sitting at 38 health. Okay. Um, uh, yeah, we're about about even. We're cl we're keeping kind of close with his health. Yeah. So my one of my favorites is uh, the Chaos that blames bees. <laughs> I've always liked yeah. that deck name. A great great name yeah what would you have one bill one that sticks out oh my Varric. uh, uh for me uh was one i i opened at uh the indie vault tour <laughs> it's uh yes or is the sensei of intimacy <laughs> so that one always gives me a good laugh <laughs> that one is good <coughs> the sensei of intimacy nice what about you severo You're too, it's your go, man. Oh, you're checking out the Soul Forge Fusion Kickstarter? Uh, by the way, anyone in chat or watching the VOD, if you go to our Twitch chat, uh, exclamation point Soul Forge uh, Kickstarter, we'll bring you to their Kickstarter site. Um, what do we recommend, starter tier and a booster box? It's it's up for discussion. I've been talking to Matt a lot about this. I know we're talking more Soul Forge over Hero Realms uh, cooperative here, but I feel like we're just getting discarded and beating them up ourselves right now. <laughs> and, I, and I hate to be doing this because Soul Forge has been on the front of our tongues for so long um starter box definitely so very wrong definitely a starter you're gonna need tokens you're gonna need play mats uh and the like tokens tokens especially and and i mean tokens by minions just minion tokens um and at least one booster because you'll have a lot of deck combinations then uh do you need to buy five boosters just depends on how many decks and how much you think you're gonna play it if you want more combinations and you want to be able to mash up a lot of different stuff, sure, we're going to be getting a bunch of boosters just because we're going to be doing stuff on air and want to be sure we're delivering more new content. But if you think about it, you buy one box, you're getting four half decks, which are all going to be different factions. And that alone gives you, was it 12 decks? Is that math right? One, two, three. Uh, it is six times the number of boxes times the number of boxes, so... Well, one box that has four half decks gives you how many decks? Combinations. One box is six combinations. Oh, it's only six combinations. So if you get the one box and you have the starter, you're going to have 12, I believe. But if you have two boxes, right. you will have uh, 24 combinations. 24 combinations. So there you go. 24 different decks with a whole bunch of different cards. Plus, you may have rare splices and you can trade with friends. So plus you can play it digitally and mash up a whole bunch of stuff and look for that half deck that you want to make your deck nuts with or something. Um, okay, so we're kind of just like, he's got a huge deck, dude. And he, he I can't determine what he's yep. trying to do besides just buy everything. Yeah, he he just has a lot of cards now. It's uh, so many. Which means he'll probably start hitting a lot harder next go around because his uh, money cards are going to be diluted. Um... So what is our strat here? Maybe out heal him? Cause you're, I, I, I mean, get dude. It seems like he's handling our dudes very easily. Uh, yep. Yeah, yeah, I think we just kind of need to get as much damage on him as we can and uh, get get champions in front of us for protection. Oh wait, I can. Do you want Do you want me to try to heal you? Oh, cause it'll heal you. Oh, it gives me an option if I clear these, right? Yes, yeah, so if you, you'll see if you uh, do the five damage to him. Uh, oh, this one's before. blocking me still. I've still got, I've still got the Tithe Priest in the way, so I can't yep, do it. Yeah, Okay. You're, you're just one off, so. For science, uh, that was for science. All right. Yeah, but you have lower health anyway, so it's probably, probably fine. Okay, so I'm at three bucks. Um, I feel like we need to like get bigger dudes yeah the orc grunt or the wolf shaman at least gives you another thing to protect the orc but i feel like money wise uh, like what are you sitting on here like you have some money you've got this influence and the prayer beads 
I just yeah, feel I like we're not. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I, I just feel like our market is savage. Indecision, I hope you lose. Thank you so much, man. Good to see you. Yeah, uh, that's that's that was my experience with Mordavos. Uh It seems like uh, he'll buy and destroy the market. Yeah. Uh, makes it tough to get what you need and buy the good cards. We haven't even had a chance to buy anything. <laughs> yep. So is yep. it worth chasing money, like taxation here? I think it's worth getting damage if yeah me too so i'm gonna go orc grunt then even though we're not green team but i'm getting yeah. rid of this thing just he's annoying yeah he just has yeah get him i don't know i just feel like playing this this guy because he's buying everything just feels like you're playing someone that got all the money and is has no strategy and you're just <laughs> we're just yep. we're just floundering here <laughs> Un unlimited money but uh he'll 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 definitely pick up the pace so oh he just punched you in the face uh, real hard yeah. yeah yeah he uh he hurt me uh that turn so and look at this you got three bucks yeah uh not a whole lot i can get do you like have elf no. elven curse is good but i don't think i'm gonna see that uh so i'm gonna try to death touch heal. Are you gonna are you gonna grab death touch though you can death touch and heal. uh do you want death touch i could get it i mean if you get death touch at least you could keep comboing off your red cards for damage yep and, and i need to start deck, then yeah and you can try to clear his his dudes while i heal you maybe which is weird <laughs> yep yep we'll try that uh i got a good upcoming hand yeah, uh the dark lord yeah and uh year I'm getting discarded on hard. Or yeah. one, one discard again. At least it's a money hand, so it's not the end of the world. Yeah, I've got five bucks though. Do I care about a dollar? Um, I don't even, I can't do anything with five dollars, let alone four dollars. Uh, yeah, I think, I think you're discarding a buck and uh, maybe using your ability and well, punch him in the face. I could undo that. I could go, I could take yeah, I mean, I could... Oh, no, I'd have to toss Rally the Troops to do that. You don't want me to grab Elven Curse? Uh, you can. You have a decently long time till you're going to... Yeah, I think I think you're right. It. Oh, he's got Rake, too. He took... My dude! My good blue my good blue man. The good blue yeah. man group. He went blue man group on us, dude. That's not cool. Yeah, he's got two uh, pretty high health uh, heroes out there. So we need to get some... I mean, it would be awesome if we could get the firebomb, right? But I don't think we're going to afford it. <laughs> yeah, at this, at this stage, I don't know that we're going to be able to afford the big cost cards, so. Well, um, I got, I got Horn of Calling, so I can make one cost less, but I just am like, I guess I'll That's take champion, that. right? You could get the six cost Berserker. Not with what's in my hand. I'm only gonna have two dollars. Oh, you're saying oh, next right, turn? Right. Next turn? I could aim for it next oh, turn. Oh, yeah. Rather mind. than taking you're my right. bow. I mean, I'll I'll go for it. Let's see if I grab some fire gems or something. Once again, I can't heal you. That sucks. I could clear his rake. Should I clear him? Uh, the rake's probably worth getting getting rid of. I have to sack my my fire gem, but what's it helping me do anyway? Nothing. Yep. Uh, or I stay on his face. No, let's get the, rid of this. The rake, if you, if you leave the rake up, I think, and he starts protecting it with some uh, taunt, it could uh, yeah, it can <laughs> be just... a regret later. Okay, so I see. You've got your own... I can attack your minions, too, though. Like, I could have taken out the, yep. the green one. I just got to look over yep. there. I got to remember that. Oh, my uh, God. I get uh, hit very hard. Yeah. Oh, look at all these minions on you, dude. Uh, I think I'll have a pretty good turn, though. I can draw some good cards. So... Twice. Yeah, you get two card draws. Nice. Yeah. Cycle. Okay. The music got very dramatic. <laughs> as soon as, <laughs> as it was the your music turn. turned down, so... Yeah. Is this out, says it? Yes. The co-op mode came out yesterday. It's still in testing, but this is the first co-op mode. It is the... Uh, they call him the pirate something? The, the super pirate? The pit pirate lord. Pirate lord. This is who we're fighting here. Um, so it's out in the in the beta app if you're part of the beta, or it's not the beta. I guess it's out of. I guess this is still beta. Beta. Yeah. Beta. Yeah. I guess it's still being developed. But this is the first co-op challenge, and this is the first time checking it out. 
for myself with Bill, and we're gonna win. Yeah, so I'm thinking, uh, I think I get this War Mage, what do you think, or the Enforcer, which one? Oh, to buy. Uh, dude, Enforcer's great, but... I can put him into play this turn with Beric. Oh, that's right. Uh, yeah. But we have no way to really proc the card draw, do we? We haven't gone blue team I don't have any blue cards. So the healing could be nice. It's Two. or, yeah. Well, it's both three damage, so it's a hard choice, right? Yeah, I and think I'll gonna... go with the utility for the heals. Yeah, he's going to take the enforcer, though, which is going to really hurt. Yeah, take the profit. Yeah, but he's not going to get to it. Uh, take the profit. Get, get this guy back. Then maybe he, if he doesn't take the Enforcer, you would have your Profit Enforcer combo for draw. All right, so how many things? All right, so we need to kill some stuff off here. Yeah, the Dire Wolf. So I could have 11 damage. Well, actually, maybe you should focus on uh, the Man at Arms. Man at Arms. And the Marauder and the Guild Mage, maybe, instead of this Dire Wolf. Direwolf sucks, but that man at arms is going to give him one, two, three, four, five, seven damage. Yeah, if I leave the wolf up though, and if you, what do you got over here? Because if we can't get rid of that wolf, uh, um, he'll make me discard a card every turn. I have four. I need to do five damage for that, right? I won't be able to kill it. Yeah. So maybe I'll kill the wolf, and you can focus on the other okay other guys if he doesn't put more out on your side so you're gonna get the wolf and the mage or the yeah oh no you're gonna have tons of damage you can totally kill the wolf the mage and the man-at-arms because you haven't played your oh yeah i have this mage. as well i'm gonna pop that oh no you'll be um, one off you'll have to leave the mage i guess yeah that's uh awesome. so we'll do that he's gonna get a lot of money which is really annoying and I'm not going to take that profit. You're not going to take the profit? Nope. Nope. It's, uh, we don't need money right now. We gotta, we gotta smash him. Oh, I was just thinking you use it to grab Enforcer. Say, ah, of course he took it immediately. Yep. <laughs> uh, sack the most weeks. Okay, he's going to sack the firebomb. No! The other advantage is, uh, you know, if we took the, the one cost card, he gets that free card, so he could have got a better free card, maybe. Hmm. Okay, well, I got my grunt, and I got the hunting bow, but I don't have any arrows. I don't have any way to draw cards, so this is my life. And I had no way to clear this guy to heal you or anything, because I'm one off. Okay, so we're at five. Um, I could grab Parop. I I'm just sad that we can't combo off each other. Um, yeah, yeah, that would be nice. I mean, I, I don't have any green cards. So I'm like, I want to take Nature's Bounty, but, you know, fine, yeah, $4? Uh, not, not, probably not good value. Well, you're about to, yeah, I don't know. Like, if I do Bribe, I could cycle. I could do my thing. You'll be uh, cycling next turn, and then potentially whatever you use that money on, the game might be over, so maybe get the Enforcer. Just take the Enforcer for the guard value? I think so. Yeah, I think just to have protection. It's health, yeah. All right, that's all I can do, dude. Or no, I can do it to his face. Do you, Or I can kill... Do you want me to kill the cult priest over here? Uh... Can I? Oh, no, I can't because I have a... Yeah. I have to kill yeah, mine before I don't before know if you're able to. You'd have to get rid of your guy first, so... Oh, okay. Dang. Well, it's going to his face then. I mean, dude, he's at 29 health. He's going to hit us for, like, 30, but... <laughs> We've got him half dead. We yeah, got him there. Yeah. Oh. Uh, he's hitting me pretty hard here. Uh, 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 <laughs> oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. How dare uh, you? Oh, the two. This feels like playing you. Yeah, that, that, that hurts. Uh, well, I saved my ability for this moment, so we might as well use it. You're going to take out Varric? Can you take out Varric? No, oh. I can only get four cost or less, so the War Mage is pretty good for yeah. that. Yep. Uh, let's this is go his... ahead and... Uh... So War Mage is coming out. Uh, Zeshin says it's called Pre-Finalized Testing. <laughs> Whatever you'd like to call it. 
Yeah, Wise Wizard did a stream today. I don't know. They, they put it in, I think, at 11 a.m., but I don't know if that means Eastern or where they're based. So I don't know if the stream happened already or isn't, ha isn't happened yet. It might be, if they're West Coast, it wouldn't be for like uh, until 15 more minutes. But they're they're doing a stream and going to be answering questions um, over on the Wise Wizard Twitch channel. So people are interested. I might check it out later for sure. Just trying, trying to stay alive. Just staying alive, dude. That's the way you got to do it. See what happened here. Pulled it. Okay, pull the War Mage. Healing. Yeah. Die, Mage. Just yeah. I guess I guess you're right. I think I think the strategy against this guy is just like go hard healing. Yeah, you have to you have to stay alive because uh, <laughs> oh, it's he, uh, he he gets real mean. Fourteen to my face. Oh, look at that. Okay. It's like card draw and healing would be nice in here. Yeah, uh, in the times that I've played against him, I haven't felt like I've ever had a chance to uh, get a bunch of money and then buy expensive cards and then go in. Right. Seems like you're kind of forced to just get what you can and make it work. Well, dude, I'm going to take... I'm thinking of taking Death Threat if we survive. Just because of the, yeah. I have the blue boys now, so... Yeah, I could draw a lot of cards if you got uh, Terab out. If I survive... Wolf form, that's it. A favorite. Alright. Don't die! <laughs> <laughs> that's all I feel like. Don't let him do another 17 damage to my face, please. Uh, 11. Alright, I only got three. Uh, oh, God, we're there. so broke. Can't heal. It's okay. I mean, it could be worse right now. Yeah, uh, we're, we're hanging on. We're hanging on, dude. We're hanging in there. I, I get to draw a buck, uh, so that's not super useful. But I think I will. I could, how much damage are you? Do you have? Let's see. Um, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, plus eleven. And if I these two guys survive, uh, let's say if they survived, I would have fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Uh, um, then I can do it again. Six. I can do 21. I can do 21 if they survive. Assuming they don't survive, okay. I have 8 damage. <laughs> 8 damage if they don't survive, so In we hand. can get them down to 7 health. Yeah. I have a feeling he's uh, going to kill them dead. Yeah, I think it's probably better for me to just swing at his face here. And yeah. hope we can finish him off. If you live, we've got 2 turns to do it. Kill the Marauder and then go for it. Yeah, I, I, if I survive, dude, we have a good chance on this. Yeah, he has to get through nine health for you, so that's at least good. All right, let's pray that his hundred card deck doesn't like work out for him. Oh gosh! Oh my god! Oh gosh! Oh, he got it gosh. in the right order. Now he's gonna get that oh. two extra. He only got right. two more damage. That wasn't, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't no. too bad. But now you got a big guy to get through. Okay, at least I got a card draw here, and I have two bucks. Oh, oh, I have a discard. Dang. Um. Yeah. Crap, man. I guess I'm tossing a gold. Shoot, I was gonna try to cycle. Yeah, you gotta have to get rid of that rock splitter. That guy's. Yeah, it wouldn't have helped me that much to cycle, because uh, it would just been I had like a money draw pile. <laughs> I needed like yeah. one more damage. Yeah, um, he could finish you off next turn. Oh, definitely. So we'll we'll see. It's gonna come down to the wire. From. Well, I got some healing. That's nice. Uh, well, I'm going to toss this to get more damage out because obviously we ain't buying anything. Money was a waste of time in this game. Uh, yeah, is Lyle yeah. secretly playing as the pirate? Yes. Uh, okay, so I'm thinking of grabbing... Might as well just grab Endweaver for damage. Yeah, it does. there's a chance you get it out. And I think they'll kill it even though it doesn't have guards. So Actually... It... You know what? No, I'm going to track. I'm going to track to get my recruit ready, hopefully, so that I have healing. Yeah, and you can discard two gold cards yeah. so you'll have a better hand next Two turn. Garbo cards. Get those here. We'll cycle out. We'll hopefully get some good cards. We'll get rid of yeah, this Rock like, Splitter. Like this. This. And then... Okay, man. Do 13 damage to yeah. his face. Win game. Just don't die. Don't die. 
And your ability lets you draw the card, right? So you'll actually be able to get the end weaver? No, my ability not? does oh. not let me draw the card. That was my special ability, which I used earlier on. Okay. To try to be cool. I tried to be cool too early. Uh-oh. It's getting hairy up in here. <laughs> well, it's four damage. Uh, you've got a lot. Dude, you could get him down. As long as I survive, as long as I don't take 18 damage, I think we're good. I think we beat right, him. All right. All right. Let's, uh, let's I think we've got him. Here. Unless he procs his Tithe Priest, but he won't proc his guys on my turn, right? Yeah. yeah so. Uh, I we will. He, uh, well, I could. I can't kill all of these guys, so I will heal. Well, you can kill the. Just you can case. kill the Death Cultist and the Marauder, and then just put it all to his face, right? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah. Uh, and heal. Yes, and heal. <laughs> yeah. And heal. Assuming I survive. Assuming I survive. Heal again. You can live to see me die. All right, six damage. All right, six damage. That brings him half down. We're almost there. Okay, okay, okay. Just don't have a bomb turn here, buddy. Come on. All right, yes. <laughs> All right. Oh, <laughs> half dead. Oh, sweet. I think we did it then. Yeah, um, looking three. pretty good. Oh, wait. I No, I didn't get enough damage. Yeah, we'll or, be a little short because he has a guard, but I can heal up though, so I'm not dead. You, you, you can finish him off. You're just gonna get final hit. Yeah, assuming he can't do thirty, uh, or I mean twenty to He's got three cards. Next turn will be all money. All right, I'm what gonna take I'm close gonna... rank so he doesn't take it. Um, and then yeah, I'm just gonna that, pop. that card's good. Ooh, I mean, I love, I love word power, word of power, but. Maybe I take Word of Power, because I was going to cycle and just set myself up for damage if for some reason... He doesn't have any healing, does he? I think he does, actually. A little bit. He does. Uh, he has a couple yellow cards, but uh, there's good chances we don't even get he, around to seeing whatever you buy, so... Well, he's going to cycle after this. Yeah. And there is healing in his draw pile. Yeah, so he could get healing, so maybe try to stop him from getting it. Uh... Well, I was going to take the word of power just to get card draw and stuff. You're yep, saying I should that's... take close ranks, though? Uh, and then in the either cycle? Either one. They're both good. If you can get recruit and close ranks, that might be the play. The most health turn? Okay. Yeah. Okay, I, I'm fine with that. Yeah, we're just staying alive. Oh, yeah. I could get Kristoff. We'll we won't be able to play those cards, but... I'm taking Kristoff, cool. dude. I'm taking Kristoff. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah. I get, that's a yeah. guard and draw cards for sure. And yep. put him at nice. four. Okay. You would have been real sad if you got word of power and you saw Kristoff pop up. Yes. I love Kristoff. Okay, man. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. No healing. No healing. Yeah. So as you saw there, he didn't use the healing ability uh, on the priest. Like, I haven't ever seen him use that ability. Oh, okay. So that's what I was worried about. So we're good. Oh, my gosh. You can kill yeah. him, dude. Take him out. Yeah, yeah. So uh, let's you know, see how you let's... see how it's done. Show us those pro strats, Bill. Do we uh, do we Beam. get all the damage out? You know. Yeah, you have all damage right now. You're you're yeah, you're the dark priest right now. All right, we did it. Nice, dude. Bam, bam, we did it. Woo! Yes. <laughs> Bill, we've done yeah. it. We are esports yeah. ready, man. This is why we're esports pros. Pro strats. <laughs> that old time we were talking Soul Forge and other games, and then we just did this little slice up this priest, oh, this pirate man. Whoa! Yeah, oh, the, man. Soul Forge prepared us for this moment. We've we've been prepared. Yeah, Star Star Realms and Soul Forge prepared prepared us for this moment. But uh, yes, we did it. We did yes, it, Phil. Uh, yeah, you know, great great work, great teamwork there. So let's get and, our uh, let's get all the XP. Yeah. Awesome. So, so can we play the Pirate Lord on a higher level, or is it always level one? I think this is the only level that they have ah. currently. Okay. Uh, but they are planning to release additional like boss encounters and co-op encounters that'll be right. probably more difficult or allow you to play higher level champions. So, so now that we've destroyed the Pirate Lord for the first time, we did it. We've taken down the Pirate Lord, Bill. Congratulations. Thank you for your help, man. We did it. What a what of a team! Um, yeah. Uh, before we jump into another one, if, if, do, would you want to do another one? 
Yeah, we can do another one. Um, are we gonna fight the pirate lord again? I mean, just for just to be like whatever. Yeah, I mean, you know, we uh, we ran him off once. We can run him off again. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess I'll come over here real quick. Uh, I just I like. So w w after playing the Pirate Lord there, it's fun. I like it. I, I can't wait till real time happens because um, that would save us. It's it's just kind of annoying seeing half your turn and then discussing and then seeing you go through it. Um, doing this in 48 hour turns, I guess, works because you can kind of watch each other at this low level thing. Uh, but the communication between us going like, we need to heal now helps a, a ton. Yeah. You know, because if I'd gone <laughs> damage, it would have been kind of just a waste of time, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's nice to coordinate and say, oh, just ignore that guy or do that right. thing. So either so. get on Discord or if you're playing on your mobile phone, sit next to your friend. <laughs> yeah. Sit yeah. next to your buddy. Yeah. So what do you, what, so just after, you've played now six games, you're now three and three, lifetime yep. uh, streak. I'm 100% win rate. Uh, I'll just say that. My win loss is 100%. <laughs> yeah, OP. That's why you got uh, 41 notifications. That's why I got 40, 40 some notifications for games. Um, what, what, what do you think about uh, Cooperative and Hero Realms? Do you, do you like it? Yeah, I think it's great uh, to give variety in the way you can play the game. Mm -hmm. uh, some people don't like playing competitively or maybe right. challenging and rather take on an encounter with someone else. So yeah uh it's always nice to have that option i like that you can level up your champions that way too if you're hesitant to jump online with a level one champion you could level them up that way first yeah and what's nice too is i guess if you're hmm yeah you're right if you don't like battling random people and playing competitively and feel like uh, you're getting ground down that way and it's just too stressful maybe or something i guess this way you hop in work with someone and still get a benefit of of using your characters i mean up to a level right up to a certain level but it's nice i guess my i'm on my way to level six i guess i just won't gain like silver or bronze statuses or anything like that from this i don't know um i'm just wondering yeah. if people could grind this for xp like now that now that we've now that we know the pirate lord right I, we're gonna play another game and i think you know, the strat will change a little bit, but maybe we could get pretty good at defeating the Pirate Lord. Like, and then we could, could you grind it out with a buddy to, to sort of over, you know, level up your characters faster versus trying to grind the ladder, I guess is what I'm saying. I think you, I think you could, uh, you get less XP if you lose, uh, I believe. Right. Uh, but in my, my couple playthroughs, it does feel like there is a element of RNG. <laughs> To winning the scenario where, depending on how the market shakes out and how sure. quickly you can get set up, uh, can make or break a game. Yeah, I mean, I think that's the game in general, right? Um, yeah, that's how it's supposed to work. I mean, that's the the thing there. But yeah, I'm I'm enjoying it too. I think it's a cool way to play online with even just random people or or buddies and still get rewarded for your time and effort. And then I don't know. I guess we'll see. We'll see as things. I hope. I, I just really hope they'll like they'll make level one pirate lord. If you beat level one pirate lord, you can then choose between level one, level two, and then level three. You know, and then how? I don't. Understand, I guess they just give them more health. Maybe they maybe figure out ways to make them more dangerous. Certain abilities, maybe certain tiers. I don't know. Maybe more XP if you there's can the defeat cards he ones. has, or his abilities, or his starting health, or something. Right. There's a lot. A lot they can do. And and I think if they optimized. Uh the way that it functions too it could also increase the difficulty like making sure the uh the captain always uh procs last right uh right. to get the extra value and uh you know with the the priest is it worth them just gaining a buck and buying a card or should they be healing themselves right totally okay so what was weird about that last game is i ended up being more just like healy stay alive do some occasional damage and you ended up being the damage priest <laughs> Yeah, I yeah, think you kind of how the market more. went uh, that game. So, so do you want to change it up? Who do you want to go with here? I'll uh, I'll go to old reliable. I can do the thief this time, and we can buy something from his discard pile that we don't want him to have. Oh, okay. So at level three, you have that ability to steal his cards. Yeah, ah. I can steal a card from him. So, um, I will go. I'm actually going to take out Mordak. I'm going to take out the wizard and see if how these all these actions work out for us because I feel like. All right, let me see if I can do this. Let me try this again. Bill, I am. Let's see. Okay, there you go. I got you that time. I must have just spelled it wrong Perfect. before. Um, I th I think what you're you're right that I think buying stuff 
unless it's like low cost, it's like it's it's pointless for us to try to even get those big boys like Dracaris and everything. <laughs> yeah, I think we're yeah. wasting our time. I, I've, uh, at least in my experience, it seems uh, that as many champions as you can draw, the better, because he will always try to to finish them off before hitting your face. Good call. So champions and I mean healing just seems so good. I mean I'm gonna try to just yeah. grab a bunch of uh, actions yep. here. What's what's my ability here? Deal four to a target champion, four to a player. Got it. Got it. Okay, cool. And you're over here. Oh, I'm first this time. Um, okay, let's throw this out. Two dollars. Well, this is dying. And this is dying. Uh, I'm not gonna draw a card. I don't see a point in that. Um, I guess just money. Yeah, I think the wizard deck starts with not that much money, right? It's hard right. to get ramped up. Yeah. It's all the it's all the actiony stuff for dr card draw. Okay, let's see what he's gonna do here. It's, uh, Three plus one for broadsides. Coming wow. hot over here. Yeah, dude, smacky in the face. Um, Looks like you're sitting on three dollar, dollar, dollar bills. I'll have six bucks next turn. Uh, uh, do I want money? Uh, I think I'm gonna heal. Heal and uh, make him discard? I feel like if we could discard him, if we could green strat him, it might help, you know? Yeah, I tried that with Mordvoss and it was uh, really good for him. And it really sucked for me because yeah. he was always hitting, hitting me for a full turn every time. And uh... <laughs> I was going to say, it, it really only works for one side. You're right. It 100% only right. works for one side because one of you yeah. has to focus he'll, it. He'll discard on your turn, so you'll get easier turns, right. which could be good because the wizard is kind of fragile, I think. Sure. Yeah, I'm already I guess at 38. I could have, could have healed you, so maybe next time I'll try to use that on you. Oh. Yeah, that's right. I'm kind of the weaker. My cloth robe. I only have cloth yeah. armor. I can only wear cloth. Remember that. Your yeah, robes. You're, so. you're, you're uh, going for uh, big damage. I'm going to try. So let's see what you did here. Throws it up and you made him discard. Are we in a holding pattern? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm done. So it's just delayed, I guess. <laughs> yeah, just waiting. Uh, I made him discard a card for you. Because it's uh, 48 hour turns, we have to wait 48 hours, guys. So, uh, 48 hour stream. Uh... <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. I mean, I'll bounce over here to see if it refreshes it. Come on, I want to see what you did. Ally. Oh, you know, oh, that, was, that was my bad. I didn't hit in turn, so. Oh, no, that... that's it. Uh, that's that's what did. I was on your board waiting to see uh, what you were going to do. and uh... I was deep in the tank, you thought. He's like, man, what? Yeah. He has three dollars, dude. Just play your cards, draw some cards, dude. What's up? <laughs> yep, yep, yep. It was a tough decision. Um, I don't have any actions there. That's right. It's too early still. Um, so next action acquires one less. Let's get some money, some money. Then we got demand. Get that bribe, maybe. Do you have a guy in front of you? No. Uh bribe. Yeah, where's bribe? Right here. Should we go bribe? Cheap bribe. Yeah, it's an action. It'll help you three dollars. Yeah. It'll help you buy some. Get some money. Things. I mean, maybe we Ooh, could build that, up to blue team before he blows up maybe, great. Maybe you can get that domination, you know? Oh, That's yeah. We can dream. You, yeah. Nah, he, he's either going to blow up domination or rake. I don't know. Or he's going to take one, right? Yeah, yeah. All right, we don't well, have the actions. Fingers crossed. Three to the face, because you don't have any guys. So, intern. Nope. All right. Okay. Yeah, that's true. Maybe you could. Uh, we could keep your side clear do some healing stuff eventually. I don't know. It's interesting. I don't know. Yeah, I, so. I find that interesting that you can't heal or attack with guys in front of you. I guess the idea is that you're busy battling and that that doesn't make sense. You're distracted. Oh, you are growing green team. I'm, I'm going uh, champions if I can. Okay, champions. That, uh, they would rally the troops. That could be good. Yeah. You can get it. Yeah, so in this case, he popped the captain, but I think it depends where it is on the battle line. If it's on the end, it'll pop afterwards, but if it's in the front, it won't. Okay, so um, we're thinking I get this rally of the troops. It's probably pretty good. Yeah. Um, yeah. I haven't gone yellow team yet, but might as well. 
Yeah, I think the health will be good for you since you're kind of fragile. Yeah, who doesn't like a rally of the troops? Uh, yeah, I'm not going to worry about that. Not going to pop my thing. Okay. Moving along pretty good here. Doesn't feel like he's got he's had a nuts buy. That other game, it felt like he bought like 900 cards <laughs> in the first two turns. Yeah. Yeah, and like you saw there, he uh, didn't use his captain ability, so... Yep. Um, he missed a damage. Right, well, I think he only missed one damage. Can't buy anything in the market. Maybe so... run some money. Or do you want to make him discard? I could steal a card from him. I don't have anything that he has that I want. Has to be a buyable card, right? Uh, I think we could leave the captain out since it's it'll be first now. We know it's not working, or do you want to get rid of it? Um... No, it's gonna be first. Just clear that dude, and yeah, let's let's play the game, man. Let's play the game. Let's not let's not try to be honest here. <laughs> All right, yeah, you know he's a he's a pirate. It's not uh, our fault. It's not our fault that he's a little well, the, wonky. The advantage of me killing him is I could heal you. Oh, turn. that's true. Uh, how much are you gonna heal me for? Two. It's just two. I feel like we need to just punch him in the face a little bit. All right. Like, I think that's better, because you're right. Let's take advantage of this fact and, and burn him down faster than, you know. We're not trying to mill him I'll, here. I'll help you by giving you one last card to deal with. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Oh, boy. Of course, he's going to grab the spark. Right? Yep. Yep. Oh, he got both sparks again, dude. Come on! You can get domination, though, or or the priest. I think the pirate spilled some rum on his Hero Realms deck, and both those sparks <laughs> are stuck together, so he, whenever he shuffles, he always gets them both back-to-back -back every time. Yeah, yeah. It's really annoying. He's, uh, He's a darn pirate. All right, so we got a ton of money. some dude. tricks. We got a yeah. ton of money today. Dom domination's looking pretty good. The priest oh. is looking good. I love Rake, though. Domination, yeah, though. How do we not take Domination? It's just like the Dark Lord. You can't not take Domination. I mean, you're going to have a lot of healing cards, so it'll be kind of yeah. nice. And I've got Rally the Troops, so double prepare once I get once I get dudes. Yep. I don't have get any a dudes. Champion. Oh, I can't wait. Cat. You can use your cat <laughs> a million times. I can proc my cat for three gold. Yes! Uh, yeah, I guess I'm going to take Domination. Yeah, because I don't, I'm not going red, but I'm going yellow team, so let's stay with the strat, huh? Die. Die. And, um... Yeah, we're keeping Probably him alive. Probably sacrifice the gym, right? You, you don't need that anymore, I think. You don't think so? What money am I rocking I think, here? I, I think you're good. You got the three-cost card. I mean, it's good. still you're high well market. It's still a spendy market. I think I'm going to hold on to it for now. All right. I, I like to have a little money in my pocket. I'm a broke wizard, man. <laughs> I worked hard for that money. My cat yeah, only does like... so many tricks for a dollar. Oh, this is it? Is this Rake? Is he gonna? Oh no, it's the Ty Tyron R. Uh, he's he's coming coming for my face here. Yeah, he's going hard, damage. Okay. You're at a uh, what? Five? Oh. Uh, yeah. Just short, dude. Just uh, short. Not a great number, but no. uh, I could uh, I could steal something from him. So. That's true. What are we going for here? What are we going for? Is it the discard I or think... his hand? It's discard. Yeah, right? it's discard. Well, I think I might uh, get the Enforcer from him. Oh. Hey, man, get your value. Get your money's worth. I mean, Deception, yeah. too. Okay. Yeah. That's card so. draw. But Enforcer is the guard, so if you're going guard strat, yeah. It's it's like health and damage, and it's something we don't have to get through. Right. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna grab to the, grab the Enforcer. Sweet. Going enforcer and uh, pass it over to you. All right. At least you cleared your dude. As long as we keep this captain just sort of solo mode, right? Yeah. The only Healing. advantage of getting rid of him is uh, if you need to oh. toss a heal my way or vice versa. The Dark Lord has risen. Oh, and look, command. You can just be like an insane yellow deck over here. Yeah. Um, okay, so I can do some card draw here. I'm gonna. I get a couple card draws here. The music just got very exciting. So I got $2 and I've got some card draw. So let's start with this. Dags. 
Um, let's throw this out. Let's throw this out. Get command for extremely cheap, you know? Okay, so I've got four dollars. Yeah, I can get command. Yeah, yeah. I think I think you get command. You know, I think, you're just uh, I think going in on uh, easy choice. I, mean, I missed the Dark Lord. Um, I could for just remove. I could remove the Street Thug for free. Yeah. Just to then do nine damage to his face. Start. Yeah, uh, I might as well, bad. right? Not a bad move. Just whatever. I don't feel like I'm. I mean, at some point we may need. That would have been nice to hold on to for the end game if we haven't at two health again. But. Yeah. Get your gold tooth pirate out of here, man. We ain't scared. We ain't scared of no gold tooth pirate. <laughs> I do need some healing though. <laughs> it would be nice to get some healing. Yeah, you're gonna need. Well, you have the healing card, so you're doing all right. You're probably. Yeah. Dude, you could get the Dark Lord. Yeah. The Dark Lord does call my name. And you're doing you're doing the deck. You're doing the deck for there's it. There's also heals, you know. I don't have any red yet. I don't have any yellow either. No. I'd say you take the Dark Lord. I mean, this is a straight Dark Lord turn. All right, we'll take him. We'll see what happens. Uh, yeah, it's the Dark Lord. I, I cannot build those guys. So uh, he'll just take some damage. What? Oh, dang! I he see he's guard. Gonna... I didn't. I didn't have enough to, to get rid of uh, that right. guy that was in front of me. Which one short? I mean, uh, um. What is he at? Is it five? I mean, I could clear him possibly. If that's our, if that's a thing that we feel like is good for us, I could toss a uh, fire gem here. Yeah, it could help. I mean, I, it'll let me heal you if we, if we want to stop him being survive. annoying. So I'll remove him, right? Rather than stop, or no, remove. I have to remove my thing, and then I can remove your thing. Yeah, yeah. I'll so I have to do both. this. Then I have to do this. Then I jump over here. And I do that. Okay. Uh, four dollar dollars. Uh, do I want to draw a card? Ah, I could get my cat or bribe. Not bad. Of course, I'm gonna do this. Take a right. damage, draw a card, yeah. get a cat. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll heal. Here. I'll heal with my cat. Yeah. Um, you got to You got to draw a card for free, so. Yeah. Um. Well, I'm gonna heal myself. I'm not gonna heal you, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. And then I guess. Your lowest. Do I want to grab another fire gem? Kind of do. I kind of do. I kind of do. I don't think we're at the point where we're super thin deck guys. I'm just super thin deck guy, gonna die guy. <laughs> yeah, at least you got the heels. You got the big heels. All right, that worked out. All right, all right. Uh, okay, not bad. Cleared my cleared my dude out, but. Uh, I feel like at this point back. last game he was hitting us for like 17. So I feel like we're doing better. Get rid of that so we can heal. We've, we've got him about halfway down, which is pretty nice. So we're, we're hanging in there. We're hanging in there pretty well. All right. So I got a guard up. I'm going to heal you, I think. Healing. Yeah, you can uh, clear these dudes, right? Yeah. And then you got $3. Uh, I mean, unless you want to grab this recruit. I mean, I would like to grab. He's probably going to steal it from me, but... Yeah, he'll get them at least. I think he just auto, auto buys the cheapest card every turn. Seems that way. Thank you for the healing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Aww. <laughs> <laughs> so you can automatically assume whatever's the lowest is going to be to him. Yeah. I mean, I could get the High Priest now, actually. Um, yeah, High Priest. High Priest is pretty good. All right, so let's go throw some command out, dude. Yeah. And if you get your prepared stuff, you could draw a lot of cards. Yeah, that was it for my card draw. I didn't... Oh, wait. No, I'm not done drawing yet. I can throw this out and draw one more card. Let's go. One time. Ah. You okay. got, still got a high priest. You still can get high priest and I, you can draw don't want me to take, too. We don't want me to take rake? I think high priest because if you, draw, you have all yeah. those yellow cards, you could like draw yeah. your whole deck, right? I agree. Yes. That would be nice. Um, I could also grab man at arms. Yeah, just or you, let's, you could draw another card this turn, too. How am I going to draw another card this turn? With your ability? Oh, right. yeah. Mm, I could get lucky. This is the yeah, risk-reward. Yeah. Let's do it. You could I'm not... get a, a real good one, and you'll be closer to getting 
through your deck again. Ah, oh, missed it. Dang. Ah, oh, dang. Okay, well, we still can grab... No, I can't grab Mana Nars, but I can get this Elven El Gift. Elven Gift is a good card. That's one of my favorite cards. Yeah, take it for a dollar. Um, that gives you good hand crafting yeah. ability, at least. Well, I haven't been set. Ooh, taxation. Done. Ooh, nice. And then say bye bye to Fire Gem. Yeah. Sack that now that it's been replaced. Yeah, yep. just because I'm not playing red team at all, like, I need the cycle. Yeah. So that's good. No red team needs cycle. Can't go red team, gotta go green team. Okay, man. He's thinking. He's thinking. Uh oh. Oh, geez. Uh oh. <laughs> he's uh, thinking that not that he's gonna kill me here soon. He had a turn, here, man. Look at this. Look at this hand. What the heck? Uh, I think I may be dead here. <laughs> and he pulled Rake right to his hand to play. Yeah. So that's the uh, saying. Sometimes you uh, just. He's nuts. That turn was crazy, dude. Just die, uh, you know. Dude, well, he just grabbed like the. He just drew the perfect hand there, which was a really. Annoying. All right, I'm gonna need you to do a lot of damage and uh, heal me up. You got some heals over there. You can get some heals on me. Yep. Let's see if he puts out any little baby boys in my way. Yeah, I can handle. Oh, uh, yeah, I can. I can handle these guys. Um. Well, mm, I can give you like I six also, health. I got some guys as well that are gonna. I can get you six health. Yeah. You can get get me some health. Yeah, because I need to do. I need to throw my rally the troops and my ignite first, so that I can clear these, and then I can throw domination. Yeah, yeah. And then we hope that I get a champion, because yeah. sadness if I don't. Because <laughs> yep. this is like yep. super. What's your? What's your? You have so you should use your ability to draw that last gold, right? Right, so and then we deck. and then we yolo. Yep. Okay, yolo time. Ready? Yep. Ally gains six health. Stay alive. Oh, oh, I got high priest, dude. Ooh. Nice. So we can nice. heal you. There we go. And we can draw a card. Sweet. Yeah. And you'll you'll be able to heal me twice with that. Yeah, that's right. Two more times. Six. I'm gonna be able to heal you for six. And check this out. Six health from taxation, man. We're keeping you alive for days. Yep. Yep. That, We're gonna draw some more turn. cards, dude. This is what we wanted. This was our thing. Do you You're want me healing me now? Do you want me to keep going with you? Uh, you know, oh, okay. if, I, if I got those champions alive, it, it probably makes some sense to yeah. uh, get a buffer. So I, I got some dudes that are going to be hitting me for seven damage. Yeah, okay, I'm going to keep preparing for him. plays. Okay, uh, I'm going to draw a card. And do you want more health than 26? More? Probably. Uh... If you can clear the champions or give me health, either one. Um, I just gave you all the health in the world, dude. All right. Uh, what are your champions yeah. looking like? I can clear Rake, which is probably pretty good. Yeah. That's might a... be. What, what do I? I only have six damage in my hand, so I can't clear yeah. him. I'll clear him. With all, that was all my damage I can do, except for my cat. I now have my cat, which I get. Throw you another heal for uh, one heal, or I could. Uh, I've got six uh, monies. Um, no yellow dudes up in here. I could go green. I could go nature's bounty. Nah. Yeah, Borg's not bad either. Yeah, Borg's pretty good. I think we take Borg because he'll take Borg. I was gonna say list for the guard value, but this has more guard value, so let's take. Yeah, if you can prepare Borg, plus he's uh, he can protect your draw cards guy. Yeah. Um. So I guess I'll throw you another, just one last heal, man. Yeah. Now, now Kristoff shows up. You know. Right now, Kristoff shows up, of course. Okay, there we go, dude. Healing. Woo! That's next level strat right there, man. Bro turn. Dude, how much did I heal you for? You were at like seven health? <laughs> yeah, eight health, I think. Yeah, so we just healed you yeah. for like 16 right there in that turn. That worked out amazingly. That was great. Yeah, that was good. That was good. Uh, Still in it. Uh, do I? Oh, I do. I can. Uh, that was a good turn. That was. Get Par Parov back on top. We got lucky, man. That's the wizard right there. Risk and reward. Uh, heal, heal. I'll discard a card for you. Nice. Healing, uh, discarding cards. Woo! That felt good. I'm that get, felt nice. I'm gonna get rid of that guy and uh, save one that I can't can't deal with. 
Okay, this is... I mean, they're not guards, but he'll he'll always, I think, go after your champions, no matter what, right? Yeah, and I'll be curious to see if this Street Thug, if he does the one gold, or if he does... Uh, damage. The actual damage. Oh, blew up our Dark Lord neighbor. Oh, he's thinning out a thousand cards in his deck. Oh, man, he wants to punch me in the face. <laughs> Killed all my friends. Yeah. Okay, so am I throwing away a dollar or damage? Um, I guess I'm throwing away a dollar. Yeah, you'll have enough to do your ability, so you should be able to draw your command. And yeah. you'll get to draw another card, too, with uh, your staff. So I'm gonna I'm gonna Elven Gift to get, hopefully, my command. Yep. You'll also Got have it. your ability, so you'll get it either way. Yeah, you're right. Um, then I'm gonna toss gold again? I guess I'm, yep. I guess I'm going yep. for damage. Uh, yeah, I, to I tossed the gold. Let's draw into this thing. Okay, I got two actions out. We can draw another card for the cycle. So this is good. Oh, uh, there you go. Look at that. Borg. We got Gross the Borgs. Strat. Um, Yeah, dude. Throw out the money. You're going to get a... Oh, uh, no. Like, Mike doesn't draw. Yeah, you're good. Uh, do I want to pop it, though? Of course I do, right? Yeah, yeah, I think you pop it and keep going because you could get uh, your draw cards guy. You That's right. You might as well not stop. Oh, up. or I could get a gold. <laughs> <laughs> at least you won't draw that gold next turn. Right. So maybe I grab Man at Arms just for the guard a bit, guardness. Yeah. Um, yeah I kind of want to grab that influence, just... but I don't know why. I think that's just greed. Uh, yeah, Man at Arms. He's damaged and Oh, free taxation! Ooh, nice. More heals. More heals. That's what we want it for. Not the money, the heals. All right, so we got this yeah. orc. We got this marauder. Um, am I clearing anything? I can't. If I clear this priest, I can't clear your dude over there. He yeah. Will... Do we care that he takes the dollar? Not really, right? We need to start hurting him. Yeah, I think you could uh, clear your guard guys and then just start hitting them in the face. Yeah. We need to start... I mean, if I have to clear this... We'll do it to heal you some more, maybe, but... Yeah. You've got some big guys you can start putting in front of him. Oh, man, he's got Rake again. Yeah, so you see how he did that one dollar there instead of the two? Yep, yep. I think they can make him a little harder if they change that. Like, the situation... Yeah, I wonder how they how they determine that. Because, I mean, I understand they have to code it to prioritize killing you, right? Not necessarily right. going greed and stacking his deck with even more stuff. But it seems like that's what it... That's what it does. And maybe that's a balance yep. thing. Yep. Or like you're saying, uh, like it's a level one pirate lord, so he'll prioritize money over the damage on a uh, creature. Maybe level two prioritizes damage over money. Yeah, yeah. Maybe on a uh, harder difficulty it would scale. Yeah. Uh, with the coding. Right. Okay. So we got to... See if we can help you over there with some damage here. Damage. Oh, recruit. Get some more healing. Um, we got a cat. Yep. Um, we can draw yep. some cards and hope we get uh, our Kraka. Yeah, yeah. I think that's the way I'm going. Dang. <laughs> we got money. We got money for days. Money for days. And we can prepare our... Oh, no, we can't prepare our cat. I didn't draw my other guy. Yeah, my next turn's gonna be really bad, by the way, if he kills my uh, champion. Uh, <laughs> I which... have one one damage. Oh, you got turn. rid of uh, you got rid of Rake. Okay. Yeah, I killed Rake. I didn't realize you handled him. Okay. Um. Yep. I left the uh, captain because he's not doing too much. Well, I might I might just clear. Should I keep doing his face or clear this tithe priest? And then I'm gonna take. Uh, the advantage of. Clearing the... He doesn't have any champions coming up, so I'd do maybe just clear the guard and get to his face. Clear the... Clear the captain? Clear the marauder and the oh, master. yeah, I already got end. rid of them. I already yeah. got rid of them. Oh, I was okay. going to do two damage to his face or three damage to his face. I was going to grab this elven curse, though. Versus the orc grunt. Yeah, yeah curse is good because it's a lot of damage. A lot of damage and a discard. And then I'll just go damage here to face. Get him into the 20s. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I like it. My little kitty cat. Maybe he's allergic to cats. 
I'd like to get this death touch. He'll probably... Oh, he didn't take it. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'd like to try to thin my deck. Go rot, I guess. Yeah, then out. Uh, actually, I'll do death. You want to do death get... touch? Yeah, I'll do death touch because it's cheaper and I can heal. And then you can get the rot. Okay. I'll try. I'll try. All right. Uh, so get rid of that. Oh, yeah, because you um, can get the oh. death touch and heal. Yeah, good call. And yeah, you can still I'm take glad, out the run. Uh, yeah. He had kind of a weak turn against me that time. That helped. I do play Keyforge. I wish I could play it more. Crit Forge, that's the name of the thing here. Can you play decks from different sets against each other? Yes. That's the beautiful thing about Keyforge is that it doesn't matter. Nothing's been rolled out. Even though the sets change and certain houses are rolled out of different sets, you can always go set to set, no matter what, which is really sick. And those are some of the most fun games as well. Oh, for sure. Playing coded decks are still some of the most powerful decks against even the newest sets and decisions. So if you have old decks, sometimes those old decks and old sets become a lot more powerful against new mechanics, and people don't expect it, which is super awesome. Yeah, and but, some old decks and sets like AOA got more powerful when new things came out. That's right. It's super awesome. That's why, I, I mean, I'm so psyched. Even though people are saying, are you super bummed that it's canceled, more like delayed, hopefully, is what I hope. I was like, no. It's like, I've got so many decks in a box over here. It's like having a board game with a million random decks. Roll a dice, play a deck, right? Like, yep. years from now, we'll be able to pull it out and have just as much fun with it, um, which would yeah. be fun. Um, okay. Boss and I were talking about that. Uh Every game feels completely unique, which I love. Every matchup. Always. Uh, yeah. It's completely a new experience, so. Well, there you go, Indecision. Play, I mean, if you have six unopened decks from years ago, like, um, do a sealed night with a friend. Just give each other a deck and play. And just play them. And, you, and then just talk about it and look at all the discovery, because you'll find stuff that you never knew was there or ever saw before, maybe, which is super sick. It's super fun. And, and like you said, it doesn't matter the set, so mix them all up in a bag or something and then just pull them out <laughs> and see what happens. Um, okay, so I've got another cool turn here. Um, I, I may, I'm I just going to draw a lot. Yeah, I mean, you um, have, you're going to get, get some major healing. Yeah, I want to I wanna do... I want to heal... I guess we both need heals, huh? Yeah, and you can so, use your Elven Gift now to keep drawn, and you can draw with your ability... Yeah, I wanted to try killing. Uh, you know, obviously I want to remove this. I want to remove all this stuff so I can maybe heal you up a bit too with all this healing. Yeah, that's sa gonna... save your taxation and your prepare, I think. But you can you can get two more card draws. Yeah. Currently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do this. Throw gold. There you go. Now you're gonna get some more damage. So you should be able to clear them out and yeah. do healing however you want to do it. Right. 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 Let's do this. Kitty cats. Um, so we got more dudes, okay, uh, and then we're gonna have, uh, I can pop this. You'll to be able get... to draw another card, too. Yeah, let's give you, let's spread the, spread the love here a little bit. Let's hey, do you're, this. You're a healing, healing man, yellow strats. That's right, that's right. I'm gonna give you some love over here. And big damage, I mean, look, over there, 18 damage, you got almost lethal right now. I had, yeah, I cleared out his guy so I could heal you rather than commit oh, okay, to that. Yeah. But you're right, yep. I probably should have done that, dang. Why does it want no, to I heal? Think I think it's good, uh, we just gotta survive. Yeah, we'll get there. Oh, got my man at arms. So, I mean, I could end up getting there. Uh, I didn't draw into our next card my other guy, though. So, that's sadness. Yeah. Um, but yeah. we did get more uh, healing here. So have you done your prepare on your high priest? You could draw another card. My prepare on my high priest? Oh, there's no... Oh, yeah, yeah, I already did that. Yeah, yeah, I'm already... Oh, sorry, okay, I know, yeah. you're watching, okay. You're looking at it delayed. <laughs> you're seeing, like, Yeah, I'm delayed. Turn. I'm not... Uh, yeah. I, was like, I guess huh? I could have a stream up on your turn, but... No, no worries. You could. You could. You could. You're not... You can totally look at my hand, and this This is what's great about it. Yeah, um, I can see what you're doing, just slightly delayed. Should I grab Life Drain? Yeah, I mean, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> yeah, and so. we can. I can start thinning out to get to our yellow turn madness. Yeah. Dude, I think we totally yeah, like stabilized. It. Yeah, I think we're in a good spot now where we probably can yeah. get rid of them. You're finally getting into card games? That's awesome, Indecision. I'm super into Ashes Reborn. I haven't played that myself. Bill, have you played Ashes? I have not. I have not played that myself. Check out Soulforge Fusion, Indecision. We're having a lot of fun, and tomorrow night we'll be doing 2v2 mode, which Matt and I had a blast with. Soulforge Fusion, 
it's got a lot of stuff. If you like Ascension, Magic the Gathering, um, Keyforge, uh, it's got so many things that are coming from so many awesome designers that it's going to be really interesting. All right. Oh, you got the Dark Lord. Nice. Uh, I don't have any one in my discard pile though, so that's not nice. <laughs> not nice. But maybe you can seal the deal. Maybe. I'm hoping. That would be awesome. I made him discard, so maybe that'll help. Another spark. I wonder who's gonna take that. Guaranteed he takes this spark. Oh gosh. Oh, he doesn't have any money. He has straight All damage. Right. He didn't buy anything. That's like the first time I've ever seen him buy yeah, anything. Yeah, weird. That was so crazy. I mean, he's got 43 more cards to see whatever he buys. Right, right, <laughs> so. right. All right. What's in here that I would want? My command would be nice. Um, Borg would actually be great. Uh, yep. So yep. I think I'm going to do that. Or, or command. Borg or command. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just, I'm just going to go for my ability here. Um, yeah, at least definitely. now I can draw again. Okay, one more time. Rolling dice. Nice, we got Borg. Okay, Borg's out. I can't proc my uh, Rally the Troops, uh, but we got 14 damage. Clear this, clear this, clear that. There you go. Should I kill the Wolf Shaman or the War Mage or just put it in his I face? I think I would kill as many as you can because you might need to be healing me soon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's true. Um, I guess we'll just... Uh, or, well, how much damage do I have? Two. You've got a lot. You're going to have... Yeah, I have a decent amount of damage next turn, so we might be able to burn him down. Yeah, you have 7, 10, what, 11? Uh, seven yeah, guaranteed 11. Range. Probably not going to... Varric's probably not going to live, so... Oh, plus Varric, yeah, if you drew that card. Maybe he got a bad hand. Maybe he got all money this time, so we'll see. Um, yeah. I'll clear this War Mage. Hopefully he doesn't pop. I don't know if he has a bunch of... I mean, he buys a whole bunch of stuff. I don't even know what's in his hand anymore. It's like, did yeah, he buy he any... has all colors. Uh, if you look oh, at he his has deck, dire he's wolf. Pretty, pretty evenly distributed, so... Well, the only proc he'll get off it is this dire wolf. So he could maybe get three damage off his wolf shaman. Besides combos. Oh, shoot. Did I just... Yeah. Can we go back? Did I not do damage? No, I cleared all my damage. Okay, we're good. Whew. I thought I just skipped my turn. <laughs> oh, my God. That scared me. Uh, yeah. All right. We got... Bye, Eric. Oh, very interesting, Rick. I didn't. I haven't played Ashes. I'm not familiar. All right. Well, uh, you know, I'm gonna need a <laughs> savage my session. Healer. Says, when I'm when I'm having to heal you and keep you alive, we're officially up the creek. Yeah, exactly. Yep. This is a bad that, time. That's how I feel. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Uh, I'm savage. I'm just sustaining right now. I'm just sustaining. I'm discarding cards for you to have big turns. You know. Yeah, man. I just I just keep funneling health into your into your veins. All right, fourteen damage. Can you can you get him? We'll see. No, we you got... can heal. You can maybe heal me this turn. Dude, I'm gonna be so rich. Got... You know, I I can buy everything this turn. Oh great. Well, I guess he's I'm not doing, buying that. He's 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 doing some damage this turn. Ooh, Grack. Good thing I had thirty health. Okay, so. Yeah. Hmm. You're not gonna be able to heal me though, I don't think. And I'm well, not maybe. gonna be I'm not gonna be able to clear this because that's nine, thirteen damage. You can draw first, you could try the draw. Yeah. Should I draw the draw with command? Probably. Dang. You can do your normal draw. This is why I needed that red guy. Yeah. Oh great. Yep, not looking good. Um at least I'll I'm gonna heal. <laughs> yeah, you'll be looking great. Kill this. What are you looking at? Oh, you're not looking at any dudes, at least. Um, well, play yeah. all these. Looks all right, like... we got to pray for 17 or, le or 16 or less. Yeah, he ain't dying anywhere. I got no damage. What do we want to take from him? Probably this Elven Curse again, right? Uh, yeah, Curse is pretty good damage for the, the cost. Um, and then, I don't know. I don't want to take Lore Weaver. You could go Cult Priest or Street Thug. Yeah, I mean, just because they're champions, I guess. I mean, the lore, the good thing about Lore, Re lore Reaver is he will... Attack that, it, right? that saves you six health. Yeah, uh, that's not bad. You're right, because he always prioritizes it, even though it's not a guard. Exactly. Right. 
Okay. Now Firebomb comes, of course. Yeah, now. Yeah. Say bye-bye to Firebomb. <laughs> yeah. Oh, he didn't even kill my uh, my guard guy. He healed up. He got money and healing turn, so that's good for you. That's really good it's Just kind of slowing us down. He's got so many cards in his deck. Uh, so let's get rid of that. Uh... uh. What are you looking like? You got a pretty good turn, I think. Yeah, I'm going to have some damage coming up, especially with Life Drain. I can start yeah, sacking some of these dollars. Life at Drain least 10. At least 10, and I could get him down to 17. 10, and I've got some, I mean, if I get Domination, Elven Curse, Rally the Troops, we could get up to 16. Depending if, yeah. if he puts anything out in front yeah. of me, right? So I think I'll just do it. To yeah, it's a lot of fun, Rick. Days. Try it out for sure. Gonna, Try it out. I'm gonna save this guy. Uh, I'm not gonna go after this guy because uh, he's gonna get gold. I think. Yeah, yeah. I think he's he's bad mode right now. Yeah. He's greedy. He's a greedy pirate, guys. He loves gold. I mean, that's probably the lore, right? Yeah. We should Love go. To, we should go to Wise Wizard stream and say, why does he always prioritize gold? And he can just Rob will just be like, because he's a pirate. <laughs> You're like, ah. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Oh, he's healing like crazy. That's annoying. Well, um, I guess we're drawing a card and discarding a card. Yeah, um, Elven Gift time. Elven Gift. And it's a gold. Great. Well, time to proc your ability. Time to proc my <laughs> ability. Time to take damage and draw a card. Oh, it's just a crappy ignite. <laughs> Dang it. Dang. Dang. Uh, this could be bad. Right. Yeah. What am I sacking? Yeah. I'm sacking this crappy gold. The uh, your draw pile right now is uh, a lot of good cards. Yeah, I've just got to stay alive, man. Just got to stay yeah. alive. Yeah, I know that the rally true. I mean, we're gonna have our yellow burst in a sec, but we just gotta believe. We gotta believe we can stay alive. Yes. I need red cards, man. Um. All right, so Marauder's dead. Uh, Endweaver's probably dead for draw, right? We don't want that to. Be yeah, it might be worth just clearing them off just so you have healing options depending on how Oh, that's true for you. Yeah. Next turn goes for me. Um, I might grab Dark Energy for sure with my four. Yeah, it's a good card. Yeah, Dark Energy, seven damage, draw a card, proc off my one red card. Yeah, I like that. Okay, we got the yellow turns hopefully here. Ugh. Yeah, because of Pirate, man, of course. Uh-oh. <laughs> I want to ask Rob that. I, I wonder what time their stream is. It might have started uh, 30 minutes ago, but it'd be curious. I'd be curious. Uh, all right. Well, oh, dude, uh, you got damage. Yeah, I don't have anything to sacrifice, so I'm not gonna thin my deck out. But I mean, you could sacrifice. Oh no, you want to heal, right? Yeah, I need to heal. I think. Yeah, and this is all good damage. Oh well. Missed. I hate how that dude. Do, how much are you? doing next turn damage wise uh six could, you, seven yeah uh, you're gonna draw either rally the troops or domination yeah uh, you could actually draw both right yeah yeah because i have my ability uh, i have the draw card off cracka and i have yeah, my so fire you're staff do good do good uh you could probably kill him next turn so i'll just swing into his face and make it easier go for it dude face 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 until he has a nuts turn where i can't i have to <laughs> like heal you and i'm like no yeah, yeah, just survive. We're in survival mode. Okay, one time, one time. Oh, oh boy. Stop it. Ow. It's nice that you can use the uh, slower animations now, too, for stream. Oh, yeah, for sure. I mean, I've got these set for the slower. I didn't change it. I, I think I can make them faster now, right? Animation yeah, speed, normal. Can. I can go slow or fast. Should I make it slow? Do you think that would be better? What happened to the market over here? Yeah, where's our market, dude? Did it just give up? Oh, no, we ran out of the deck, dude. The deck's out. This is it. Oh, wow. This is the end of I've the never, game. Never, never gotten to this Whoa, phase. Whoa, dude, we've, we've, we've gone. His whole deck is the market. Look at his deck. It's like... He can buy fire gems now. That's it. <laughs> oh, my gosh. He bought everything in the market and destroyed everything. That is insane. I've never seen this either. First time? Mission accomplished, dude. Mission, Mission. Accomplished. Uh, accomplished. Yeah, like the fatigue. The yeah. first time fatigue pop. We did it. So, okay, let's do this. Let's draw a card. 
Yeah. Oh, I should have cleared so I can heal you. Not that we need to. Yeah, it's fine. I have to blow through I, these. I think you'll be able to kill him this turn. I just need 13 damage now. Oh, I need to heal too. I'm at 9 health. Oh my gosh. I just realized. Yeah. Yeah. I need, uh, uh... I need some health. <laughs> uh, I'm at 12. I need one more damage. There it is. Right there. Let's draw another card. There and it's a garbo card. Boom. Boom. Should we just BM this thing? Of course we gotta BM it, right? <laughs> we gotta yeah, BM it. Yeah, you know. We'll, we'll kill yeah. him off with the cat, dude. We'll make sure the cat gets his revenge on this guy. Yeah. The cat is the final damage. Yeah. Ready, ready cat familiar. Ready cat familiar. Yeah. I mean, you can even, uh, you know, draw another card just to BM some more. We can heal... Get up there. How would I draw another card? Oh, you're right. I could. I could draw another card. Get some more damage to draw another card. There we go. This is how it goes. And we'll heal you. That's never been so powerful. Right. Look at this. Our, our health totals. Oh, man. I should have procced this again. Could have had more health. I can't afford firebomb, sadly. But it's time to win, dude. Boom. We did it, dude. Woo! Woo! No problem. No problem, guys. Boom. There's the crit. We did it, Bill. Two for two. It was looking a little dicey, but uh, thanks to the mega heals, yes. pulled it out. Yeah, dude, we had some massive heals. I think the biggest one was like, yeah, crazy health, crazy health. But that was awesome, man. Woo! Awesome, awesome, yeah, for sure. No yeah. match. We got it, guys. We got it. That was really fun. That one, that that was definitely a lot different than the first one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can you can definitely see the RNG come into play. Oh yeah, yeah. Lunchtime for the okay. Have fun, Rick. That's right. It's lunchtime for the the West Coast. Hope you go and enjoy your lunch and um, go check this out, guys. It's a lot of fun, uh, dude. I had a blast, man. Thank you so much for joining me for playing this today. Um, yeah, of course. Thanks for having me. That was a good time. Yeah, dude. I, I appreciate it. This man. Uh, I can't wait to see it and make it harder. I mean, we hit we hit a new milestone, dude. We did a first. It wasn't the first time we hit fatigue. We literally drained the market. <laughs> So we have yeah, that. Yeah, that was wild. I, I didn't know if it was a glitch or what, but. Yeah, I know. We were, I was looking at it too. I'm like, is it because I pulled up the settings? <laughs> that was going to be bad. But um, yeah, dude, I look forward to playing this some more. I mean, it's 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 a fun little challenge. Uh, it'll be interesting. I'm going to accept Drew's invite here and try the 48 hour kind of like alternating turns. Um, yep. You know, and obviously it's going to take a little bit and see if I, I think it will be more challenging that way just because you and I were communicating a lot, right? Like, heal me up, heal me up, go for the yellow turn. I'll keep just trying to survive. Yeah. yeah. Um, so it's going to be, especially if you've got other matches going on, even just 1v1s or multiple co op games, that could be confusing. <laughs> yeah, it's easy to lose sight of what you're going for. Uh, yeah. Or, or where things stand. Right. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, it's a little bit more of a challenge without uh, without that communication. Yeah, no, I think I think communicating helps a ton, or even just being in chat room or something. I don't know, but I guess it just makes yeah. it more exciting. Like you're you're almost like in a blind battle trying to help each other out or or surprising each other when they do something, which would be awesome. Yeah, um, and it's, and it's fun to try new champions out, try different strats. Yeah, exactly. We did. We drew, did. We try four different champions right there. I think we did. Yep. And, yep. and and again, I was more healer, and you were more. It was, then it ended up switching around, <laughs> doing damage right. dealing and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I think you were doing a lot of both. Right. Uh, yeah, I got I mean, some good cards. What was interesting was you're right when it when you reference the hero. I mean, the wizards. I I love playing wizard. I've been playing like you said. I played hunter at first a lot, and then I jumped to priest and wizard. I just really like yep. the risk reward of wizard, and it just feels really good um, to get that that cycle going when you nail it. Um, yeah, it, you know, sometimes when you just get a gold, you're like, dang it, <laughs> and it all falls apart. Yeah, the, the card draw is really nice. Uh, yeah, and uh, the healing with yellow, yeah, helps uh, helps mitigate yeah the glass cannon nature. Oh my gosh, yeah, totally. But uh, no, I love I love priest, love building it up. But yeah, my uh, thief, I just haven't played enough. But that was really nice, getting those extra little heals and kind of slowing him down a little bit. I think that's probably why the game went a lot longer. Is we were actually able to slow them down at times i think with discards which was interesting more than we we didn't do any discarding i don't think the first game right on him no not not at all i don't think right yeah i think we were a little uh under on his discarding but um yeah good times uh session saying so wednesday night stream that's right uh be sure you come through bill's been joining us for soul forge fusion we were talking about it a bunch today uh it's been a lot of fun we're going to be playing the 2v2 mode i'm not 100 percent sure when this mod version is going to come out officially um, we were doing like a, uh, we sort of copied and pasted boards. So one person got to do scripted and one person didn't, which was really sketchy. 
Um, and uh, so this is going to be the official mod put out by Stoneblade. We'll be playing with the devs. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun hanging out with them, ask some questions. We're going to see new cards. We're going to be able to talk about what's changed in uh, the new hybrid deck game from Stoneblade Entertainment. Um, so keep an eye on their Twitter. They'll be putting that out. But 7.30 p.m. Eastern Time, special Wednesday night stream with Sensei Sice. Uh, I know Bill's going to be there, or Bill's going to at least check it out. Uh, because you guys got to see this mode. It's it's fun. We just did some co-op here. It's this same table talk, but against two other people that are having the same table talk, except we're the pirate, and we're there the pirate, you know? <laughs> and he can listen in and counter everything we do. So um, check it out. Check out Soulforge Fusion right now. Uh, it's still on Kickstarter. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. And do sure you check out Hero Realms Digital. Uh, I'm gonna, we're gonna get going, and guys, we do owe you a bunch of spins, a lot of support, it's a little crazy right now, just, uh, with timings and stuff without Lyle being here, but we will get to that, we're gonna have to do something where it's just, like, pure workout stream, probably Thursday, and I'll probably get injured, that's probably what's gonna happen, Bill, <laughs> so, it's gonna be a lot of fun, we're gonna be seeing you guys on the next one, it's gonna be rocking and rolling, we're gonna have a blast, we'll see you guys tomorrow 7 30 p.m come play some soul forge check out hero realms if you want to play a game hit me up crit camp i'm crit camp on there if you just want to battle me that's fun too check out bill play bill hang out in the discord with us ask games let's talk it's gonna be a lot of fun peace good gaming everyone we'll see you tomorrow night oh bye bye